owner of Bustable World Co. Today is going to be a small video of my new Janome HD1400. I can't believe it, you guys. Like, I have a new sewing machine. Like, it's way, way beyond more than I ever thought and expected and knew of. So, I want to say a special shout out to, special thank you to Connie. From Scandies. I'm currently catching up on Connie's life for her so long. She's doing a tote, so if you guys haven't checked it out, I will leave her link down below so you guys can check it out. In case you're not following her, go and subscribe. We all make the same items or way different items, and it's so awesome and amazing. Like, I can't even tell you how many times, like, the support is amazing. Like, we're all there for each other, we all learn from each other. And we're here to teach you guys whatever we can, you know? So yeah, so thankfully hubby took this out already so I can put the box to the side. I already put fabric in there, y'all. Like, I need to organize my work with fabric. So this is a Janome. This is my first, like, I've only had brother items, I would say. So this is my first Janome HD 1400 first sewing machine like i can tell you guys my sewing machine i couldn't change the length the width of the stitch it was just one two three pretty much i had about 12 different options of stitching that's it and my tension that's all i could do and back stitch that's all i could do this one it is like i can't even say 2.0 because it's beyond that like it's heavy duty i watched a few videos of the like of reviews of machines because obviously, yeah, she told me the model and everything. I was so excited. But also, I've been so busy. I've been beyond blessed lately. You know, also my P800 was messing up so many times. Like, I have such a massive, massive order of 60 items, right? So it messed up on me at least 10 times. And then some of the times it would take me about an hour to fix it. But I just got it serviced a couple months back, so... I don't know, her radio went away. But I just got it serviced a few months back, and every time you get it serviced, it's between 130 to 200 and something. Depends where you go. So, literally, I've taken it apart, not all the way, but I've taken it apart, like, most of it, and I've cleaned places that I've never cleaned or people have probably even thought of. So, I am learning as I go on my P800. I'm learning it, and I'm thinking as... The better I get, I'm going to make a video on it, how to deep clean it, how to give it maintenance yourself, you know, because I'm sure maybe a lot of us don't do it. Like I wasn't doing the kind of maintenance that I've been doing on it lately because it's needed, because I'm trying to fix the problem, find the problem, you know. So let me get back to topic and show you guys this beauty. Like I am so in love, like I can't wait to try it, but like I said, I have about 60, a 60 item order, which I am going to make a video about that. It's going to be short, maybe, because it's just me on my P800. Like, I have not recorded as much because obviously it's just doing the same thing all over again, all over again. So, yeah, um, let me show y'all. Part of that order, it's 10 masks, so I'm excited, which I'm almost done with them. But I'm excited to just finish the last little details on this beauty. So, let me open it. look at this like I kind of want to just zoom in just to the machine like my face is not even important y'all like don't mind the video once y'all see only the machine and it is a little bit heavy I would say I wanted to mention that Connie is live she's Connie from Scandies so she's live every Sunday about 6.30 Central Standard Time. Every Sunday she'll be live. Unless obviously if it was something to come up. But yeah, she'll be doing a sew along every other Sunday. Just like all of us three girls. Whenever it's not her sew along, she can do any kind of videos. Amber is Mondays. She's Amber from Big and Bliss. She's live every Monday at 8.30 Mountain Time, I believe. And I'm live every Tuesday about 6 or 6 30. okay y'all so I've decided to turn my camera hopefully it's not a rookie mistake but 
I want you guys to be able to read with me and see what it has because the other way would have been backwards. So it came with all of these items. It has needles, bobbins, thread cutter, oil, and excuse my... Okay, I don't know the terminology for every single thing in this bag, but, or if I forget, I'm just going to skip through, you know, because sometimes I'm recording and I forget the name of things. So needles, bobbins, oil, the little foot for different things to make, um, thread cutter, I believe. Right here, I am not sure what it has, you guys. Why? because i have not been able to experience a sewing machine like this one so i am going to have to try it out and learn obviously as as you know like this one i don't even know what all this is for so definitely i'm going to be calling connie like believe me i'm going to be calling her you know because yeah i can watch youtube videos but i can learn from her she's such a master like she has a janome and everything so i will be calling her like my other sewing machine didn't have like a button um hole maker and stuff like that this one does like it is insane it is so amazing all the different things that it can you can make with it so let me put everything together obviously i'll learn little by little like i'm not going to learn the whole machine but whatever i learn at the time i can just help anybody out that has a question about it All right, on this bag, it has the foot presser. I love that it has a foot presser, like, because that's all I've, I've experienced, so it's a lot easier for me. And then it looks heavy duty, y'all, like, the grip on it and everything. And it's black, my favorite color. Like, I can't wait to use it. How awesome. This is for the power cord, and this is to connect it to the sewing machine. Okay, here are the instructions. Okay, I'll read this one in a little bit. I wanted to show y'all how cute this is. It's a little compartment. You just pull it and slide it to the side. It has the bobbin holder in here. I don't know what this is called, y'all. I'm so sorry. I don't, but like I said, I'm... I don't claim to know be a pro or anything or know every single sewing machine. I know my current sewing machine, but it's just very, very basic. So this is like the bobbins to hold them. Any extra needles or things I can put in here. That is so awesome. And I close it like that. Okay. Let me pull this out to the side so there's a little... There's like a little button right here that you press. I believe that's what helps pulling it out. So this comes out. You slide this to the front and then here's your bobbin case and everything. There's a little lever to raise your, is it called dial feet or I forgot. I'm sorry, I can't think of the name. I'm so nervous, but you can move it up and down right here it has a little button for your bottom feet i forgot what those are called too like like i'm saying i don't claim to know every single name the whole terminology of everything i'm self-taught you know like but i've learned you know i i know how to make things so this is super awesome right here it gives you the measurements from Three eighths of an inch, four eighths, five eighths, six eighths, you know. So that's pretty awesome. I like it. You put this back in. Let me see. I'm trying to be all gentle and everything. There you go. Then it's locked. It has right here centimeters to inches. That is so awesome. I seriously love this. Also, did you guys know that this is 
a tween needle machine too. I've never had a tween needle, so I didn't even know much about them. But yeah, so it, it does say in the description that it has a tween needle. It has a needle threader right here. And I believe it has right here a needle, um, a thread cutter right here on the side. That is so awesome. I will probably be using it all my life this Tuesday because it is a sew along. Right here, it's for the tension. Right here, you get to choose what kind of stitching you want, the length and the width. Here's the handle and the here's for it to hold your threads if you're using two at a time. And this is your bobbin threader if you need to. So yeah, like this is so awesome. Like I'm gonna set it up and probably do a little clip of me using it, maybe. But yeah, like I was mentioning, I'm really thinking of giving my sewing machine to my little sister so she can at least learn basics if she would like to. Um, I would love for her to use it and we can work on things together. Obviously not all the time. Kids nowadays are not as crafty as we are, you know, and everything. So yeah. So yeah, like we'll see. I would love to teach her, you know, at least just basics. I would love to make a video with her and I. Okay, so this video, I think I'm just gonna be all over the place maybe. I'm just so talkative now, but actually the lights just went off. I ended up turning off my sewing machine, my embroidery machine, because I don't want anything bad to happen. So I'm going to have to call it quits for today because the weather here, it's so cold. It's never this cold in Houston. Never. Like, it's about 10 degrees. So, yes, I'm so sorry. I'm just going to probably end up downloading this video and as I learn more, I will keep you guys updated. I'll continue with this big order tomorrow because I do not want to risk any of my machines messing up. So yeah, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Take care. I hope you're all doing well and everything. I am going to have another video coming up of me using a thermal printer. So keep an eye out for that. And of course, my live is coming up for a sew along. So everybody take care. See y'all soon. Bye.